Welcome everyone to Neverwinter on PC. My name is Reiner and today we're going to look at the Variety Fashion Pack. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like. And if you would like to see more informational videos about Neverwinter, hit the subscribe button. Oh boy, this pack. Uh, it's a good thing that the drop rate on this Variety Fashion Pack is pretty low. Um, it's about 2% uh, chance on the Undying Lockbox to get this pack. Why is it a good thing? Well, this pack currently on PC is only worth about 7000 AD. Not the kind of value you want to get for your enchanted key. Talk about a letdown. Um, is this failed experiment number two? Let's look at this pack in a little bit more detail. First we're going to look at what is in this pack. Um, then I'm going to open 911 of them and then we will take a look at the drop rate if anyone cares about it. Um, after the drop rates I will try to determine what the real value of the, this pack should be. Uh, so it is 7000 but should be more or less. Uh, and finally we will do another fashion show. Uh, this time I will not do it on a Dragonborn race, of course. Uh, I will do the fashion uh, show on this uh, Wood Elf and I also have a human uh, male character. So we have the male and female version of the fashion. So, first the contents. That's not the right button. Uh, first the contents. Um, this pack actually contains a ton of different fashion packs. Um, too bad fashion still isn't really attractive as a mechanism. Where's my wardrobe cryptic? Um, anyway, we have in here a Chilton Merchant Fashion Box, we have Chilton Adventurer Fashion Pack, Nianzaru Noble, Vestments of the Wind, Courts and Wear. Anyway, I looked up all of the AD prices. I'm not gonna read them all, you can also see that. Uh, and I already saw that if you get one of each, oh, you also get a random die pack. I didn't even see that. All right, so that's a bonus. I, I'm not going. I'm not actually taking that long. Uh, so you get one of the top ones and the die packs. So you can also die one, but only the top rewards. If the drop rates of them are equal, you will already have a prop of profit. Uh, the expensive stuff in here is the wedding attire, for example, this uh, wedding attire fashion pack is worth 40,000 AD, so a lot more than the 7,000 that this pack is worth. Courtesan wear is about 31,000 AD, then you have the Feywild Regalia, which is 20,000 AD approximately, Jester's Motley 15,000, and then you have Garments of the Mystic Veil, Sun Elf, Nobles Regalia, and Thean Patricians Regalia, which are all 10,000 AD. So those are all the better drops. And Wedding Attire, as I said, is the best one. So, um, yeah, so we also get a random die pack. I hope this stuff stacks. I'm afraid it will not. Uh, and we will have a lot of overflow. But yeah, let's see. Elemental Ember die pack. Okay. The die is stacking. Oh, we have purple die actually. Nightmare die pack. And yeah, I'm not seeing. Uh, okay, this is going to be a lot of overflow stuff. Um. Doo -doo 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 -doo. I'm just going to open all of these and then uh, I will sort through them. Well, you can see, you see, I'm opening everything here. It's not that interesting, the opening itself, because there's no jackpots in here. I saw that the only purples are probably dice. Let's just take a look at the dice for a second when we're done with this. more is this the Feywild stuff yeah I guess so the butterfly so we're getting a lot of the doubles a uh, wedding attire oh, 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 oh. 
Okay, that sucks. Uh, let me see. So we opened uh, one Vestments of the Winds. Whoops. We opened five Vestments of the Wind already. Okay, whatever. Um, I'm going to sort through all this stuff. And then I'll come back with the uh, drop rates of everything. Well, let's let's just look at the die packs. Let's sort this. Uh, here we have 50 of the Nightmare die pack. I think that's the only epic stuff in here. I don't see anything else in here that's epic. I don't know if this is worth a lot. I heard that the yellow dye is worth a lot at the moment. But yeah, there's also a lot of different kinds of dye and also dye remover in here. So uh, as I said, I will add everything up and then I'll be back with you guys. Okay, so what I already noticed is that there's actually one more pack in um, this variety fashion pack so it's not 18 but it's 19 different ones there's also the moon silver regalia and there's this one that's also in there but it is not in the description i guess that needs to be fixed anyway i've cleaned this up so let's bring in the second batch uh, ugh, there's two more batches jesus uh, okay let's sort this again and I will add this up again and then uh, I guess I'll be back at the end. You don't have to see all these steps. I'll be back when everything is added up and uh, I have the percentages. All right, uh, I am back. Uh, the drop rates. Well, from see, seeing the drop rates, I think they're just all about the same around five percent but let's just go through them as i got them the chilton merchant fashion box church chilton merch i think it's probably this one uh we got 6.7 percent the thane patricius regalia which is worth ten thousand. we got 6.48 the wedding attire actually we got quite a lot uh 6.37 percent this is the one that's forty thousand uh the other big one we got on the other side of the spectrum caught somewhere which is about 31,000 ad on pc is about 3.95 percent anyway i will put all the percentages of course back in the description again let's do this fashion show um i have all the packs now here in my fashion items box yes it's big preview um, I'm already wearing something else, but this is of course not from this pack. So let's start with the Chilton Adventurous Headwear. Oh god, really? Okay, at least we can do this. So this is the Chilton Adventurer stuff. Now we go to the Chilton Merchant Fashion Pack. Very uh, Middle Eastern look. Then the courtesan wear. A lot of skin. It's pretty nice. And of course, as I said, I will also do this on a guy, so the fashion will look different there. Let's go for the Cordly, so this is uh, a little bit old-fashioned uh, with the big hips models with a corset I think this is should be yeah okay then we have Alamno we were here Feywilds the butterfly stuff I've seen some people wear this before. 
before this is quite nice actually this looks pretty nice then the elemental earth okay this is a little less ladylike don't really like the pants or the shirt to be honest I also don't like the mask that much but hey h1 for himself of course not my color scheme then the fire stuff this is a lot better just don't like the hat that much it's elemental fire headdress of the this is the mystic veil stuff River District uh, really looks like River District stuff, and that's also the Mystic Veil, of course. Not bad, but weird hat again, in my opinion. Uh, Jester's hat of Jester stuff. Okay. That's like only wearing a bra and some horns on the head. Also, horny shoes. Uh, let's see moon silver stuff again a fancy dress looks pretty nice uh, then we get to the noble stuff okay the dress doesn't look very noble in my eyes but that could be me it does have a mask that's something you like with a strap next up no more noble uh, but this is Nyanzaru noble stuff okay very Middle Eastern again like a trader from the Middle East mm -hmm. shoe ceremonial stuff Okay, interesting headpiece. And not a fancy dress. It's a shame that the lag is clipping through. Um, next up, Sun Elf Noble. More noble stuff. A lot of noble stuff. Again, lag clipping through. Pay and Patrician. Mm -hmm. Not bad. Then we get to the Termian Merchants stuff. Okay. Wow, am I bold now? Holy, what? Why does this... Okay, th this gear actually makes you look like a bold peasant. Wow. Uh, okay, not, not for me. Um, the wind set, garments of the wind. Okay, very grey and dull. Also not for me. And then we have the wedding attire. Which, of course, is a big, big, beautiful wedding dress. I actually really, really like this one. It looks really nice. Not really a combat uh, stuff, but it's fashion, of course. So, uh, that's the stuff on um, the female character. I will move to a male character, but we will do the same thing. Okay, uh, so here we are on my Guardian Fighter, which is a human male, so relatively standard guy. He's wearing the Dragonborn stuff, which is of course not in the spec, but we will go through all the items in the spec. Should be 19 sets, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and 9, yep. So the Mystic Veil stuff, so the River District pack. Yeah, you really look like uh, Lucan, he's called. 
I'm not really sure of his name, but you look like this uh, boss from River District like this. Then we get to the elemental water stuff. Wow, this looks weird. It's like you've been swimming in the sea for too long, dragged along the bottom of the sea. This is so weird. Okay. Uh, Jester set. Yeah, a little bit as expected. Very covered. Uh, in contrast to the <laughs> female set, which is very, very open. Uh, Elemental fire. Yeah, looks very similar to the female set. With the back piece behind the head, of course. Mm -hmm. Now we get to the adventure, Chilton adventure set. Yeah, it's okay. It's not that special in my opinion. Moon silver set. Yeah, fits the female set. Mm. Not a fan. Let's see if we can get something nicer. Chilton merchant set. Yeah, very, very Middle Eastern, of course. The Feywild, I don't think we're going to be a butterfly. We are going to be a butterfly, okay. For a male, this is a little bit weird, of course. Looks a bit like Peter Pan with wings. I don't think Peter Pan had wings. But here we do. Um, Elemental Earth. This one was very ugly on the female. And it's the same thing on the male set. So this is not my favorite. Uh, the Noble, Noble Finery sets. Yeah, very plain. Nothing special. Uh, Nyanzaro Noble. Yep. Yeah. Turban and nothing that special either. I guess it fits a little bit of your lot and port Um Then the shoe ceremonial set. Looks very weird on a man, if I must say. It's a bit odd. Sun Elf Noble. What's this in the hair? We got a hair piece. All right. It's okay, I guess. Um, next up, the and Patrician set. This was already bound, yes. Thay and Patrician. It's okay, I guess. I sound very picky when it comes to fashion for some reason oh it also has this hair piece do i always have that wait uh hat oh yeah it's part of my character that's a bit odd uh next up let me put this back on Ninzaro Noble we had, this one we had, Sun Elf we had, Thermian Merchant. This one made us look like a peasant, a bold peasant on the female. We're not bold here. It's a little bit better than the female part, but also this not not the best. Uh, the Wind set, a very cheap set also, and I can see why. A little bit weird. Elemental evil set, I guess. And a wedding attire, which should be a smoking, I guess. Oh, no. Oh, okay, it's old-fashioned wedding gear. Yeah, this looks pretty fancy. I can see why this uh, wedding set is the most expensive one. This is really well designed. A lot of detail. So, um, yeah, that's 
everything I guess for this video um, as I said I will oh uh, one last thing we forgot the uh, AD value of the pack uh, which will be in the description of course but if I add everything up and I have to say I didn't add the moon silver set let me see eh, middle of the road I guess let's give it a value and this is an guesstimation of course I can fix this later on but let's make it a value of like 3500 so half the price of the pack um, then we get to a total value spent on the packs of six point, let's say 6.4 million and the end value of all the fashion items in here is 8.6 million but yeah of course you have to sell everything uh, the pack should be worth about 9500 AD so it is too cheap uh, so if you get it too bad it's 1 in 50 but uh, yeah just open it maybe you get something nice uh, and you can store your fashion in the separate bag so it's not in the way I guess um, yeah that's for that's it for the video um, if you have any remarks in this video or any suggestions on what to investigate next feel free to leave a comment below and don't forget to subscribe Thank you so much for watching and see you in the next video.